Hi, I'm Debbie Ridpath-Owey, author and illustrator of Sam and Eva from Simon & Schuster. Eva wants to draw with Sam, but Sam does not want to draw with Eva. This can mean only one thing, a creative clash. But when things go from masterpiece to mayhem, will Sam stay stubbornly solo? Or will he realize that sometimes the best work starts with teamwork? I'd like to read a little bit of my book to you now. Sam had just begun to draw when Eva arrived. I like your pony, Eva said. It's a velociraptor, said Sam. Eva suggested a collaboration. Sam declined. Who said you could add a cat, asked Sam. It's not a cat, Eva said. It's a marmot. So if you want to find out next, please read the rest of the book. But now I am going to tell you a little bit about what inspired the book and how I created it. So back in university, my friend Reed and I used to have cartoon wars. Years later, I continued to collaborate on comics and other art with my nephews and nieces. Once I decided I wanted to write about creative collaboration, I began taking notes. I wrote up the story, I revised it over and over and over again. There were many days I felt like this. One thing I've learned as a children's book author and illustrator is that it's okay not to be perfect the first time. Sometimes you need help. Here are some of my friends at Simon & Schuster who helped me along the way. So once I have the story pretty much finished, then I start working on the art. I make lots and lots of sketches, including fine-tuning what I'd like the characters to look like. Sometimes the work is easy, sometimes it's not so easy, sometimes I have to do something like this when I'm having trouble figuring out a certain position. I used that reference photo when I was working on an illustration where chaos was happening and Sam was kind of flinching and going, draw fast. Here's the final version. And then it was time to brainstorm cover ideas. And once everything was all finished, I sent it in and eventually in the mail, <gasps> I got my printer proofs, which was very, very exciting. I hope you enjoyed hearing about Sam and Eva. If you'd like to find out more and get some free activities, please check my website. And above all, keep reading.